right, good morning everybody. We're about to head out and hit some of the uh, Salisbury Lanes. The Salisbury Lanes on Salisbury Plains. First we've got to get out of the field without crashing. <laughs> So yeah, it was fairly chilly last night in the tent. The air, the, just the air was cold after the sun went down. Uh, See, so yeah, I was a bit cold throughout the night, but not too bad. I managed to warm up. And uh, yeah, as soon as the sun caught this morning, it was like really warm, so. It was good. But yeah, we had a bit of a barbecue last night. And some beers. It was a low carb barbecue, because unfortunately, Hippo Drones forgot to bring the bread which he thought he had on him so we didn't buy any when we were at the shop just before we got to the campsite um, so yeah <laughs> it wasn't until the meat was already cooking that we realized we've got no bread ABS off, off, yeah, that's off. hopefully that's done it <laughs> okay then First time off road properly on the Tiger. I'm not nervous, you're nervous. Well, we're definitely dirty now. <laughs> ah, nice little tiger. Through that easy. It's not, didn't feel too slippy underneath either, so that'd be my main concern, is completely losing traction on uh, anything like this. deeper than I expected. <laughs> See Stonehenge. Cue the music, but it'll have to be in your head. So imagine Spinal Tap. In ancient times, hundreds of years before the dawn of history, So this is the cheap place to come and uh, see Stonehenge because you could just drive down here and park up at the side. And uh, I don't think uh, English Heritage, I don't think they really like it, but uh, when you charge an extortionate amount for a car park just to see some rocks, can you really blame people? Right, let's go get shot by tanks. <laughs>
Oh, this is cool. Nice wide open spaces. It's very rutty. tank. Uh, I'm guessing that's the one they use. I guess they use that one for target practice. Oh, what was that? <laughs> I heard uh, a metal clang back there. I'm, I'm not sure if it was my bike or just something I hit. Ah, yeah. No problem. <laughs> I heard a, a, a metal clang. I just hit a piece of shrapnel, that's all. Yeah, it's a bit of shrapnel or something. <laughs> yeah. Potentially a deep one. Yeah, let's go. Let's go off-road. <laughs> well, let's go round it. <laughs> oh, that was the first dodgy bit of mud that was actually slippy. Yeah, <laughs> that was the first squeaky bum moment. Please don't be a puncture. I think it was just a stone just pinging out from uh, under my tyre. Ah. Oh, I didn't like that last bit. <laughs> Oof. <laughs> 
some horrible noises coming from my tyres. Some stones pop pinging out from underneath. Is it? It's actually quite a brutal road in a way. Because, yeah, it's got these big stones on it. And it doesn't take much to sort of upset your navigation. But yeah, it just it seems to just go on for ages. It's not like the byways of uh, Surrey, where you know they're all you know a couple of miles long. These are just miles and miles of open space and not many people and it's fucking great. <laughs> See for miles. This is awesome. This is, yeah. A fantastic adventure. I'm glad the lanes have been pretty good uh, for my bike. <laughs> just about suitable enough for these lanes. Didn't they come somewhere like this on Top Gear, I think, ages ago? Oh, it's not that way, is it? That looks... Looks a bit rough, but we'll try it. Ah. Yeah, <laughs> uh, just figuring the best way over. Good up, Phil. Oh, he's down. Ah. You alright, mate? I knew that was a bad line. Yeah. <laughs> Keep going. Oh, my feet are slipping. <laughs> Nearly there, Phil. Nearly there. A little bit more. There we go. We're good. <laughs> It's like clay. Yeah, I probably should have waited. <laughs> Go for it. Ah, you bastard. <laughs> Nicely done, sir. Let's give it a go. Yeah. Okay, time for the Germans. <laughs> Look at all the mud coming off the tyre. Feels all right, this does. Hope Pez remember what happened last time I had to go on one of his bikes. Okay, damage report. Uh, none as far as we can tell. Just It just bent the handguard of my mirror out of the way. That is all. So, uh, yeah, should be fine. <laughs> 